Right. Uh, let's say adult guests are not allowed to use the facilities. So what are the keywords? Adult guests not allowed use the facilities. Those are the keywords. So when you just go to that para, you need to just find out uh, keywords matching to these which are in this question part. Okay. So which is the para? In which para you got the answer? Huh? Third para? Third para or third line? <laughs> First para? Third line, no? Yeah. So can you please mention the sentence that you got the answer? <clears throat> yes. It is there in that. Uh, just come to that second line. Uh, first line, letter part, guests are required to register, pay the current guest fee and must be accompanied by a member. So here it says guests are required to register. That means guest, that means they just allow guests. Uh, but pay the current guest fee and must be accompanied by a member. Guests are allowed only when they are accompanied by a member of that club or something like that. So then what is the answer we want to find from that list from A to G? Answer is, now here we are given adults are not allowed. So that means earlier we just discussed adults are allowed when they are with the members. So adults are not allowed when they are not with the members. Then he says, unless a member is with them. So unless a member is with them, guests are not allowed. Then the answer is E. Answer is C. None members can visit the gym. None members can visit, visit the gym. None members means guests no. Guests can visit the gym. Yes, it is there. When you just come to that line number three, each member can introduce the same person no more than six times per year as a guest. So non-members can visit the gym. When? Koi vela Yes. Up to six occasion under guest terms. Non-members can visit the gym because in that paragraph part we are given each member can introduce the same person no more than six times per year. That means guest can visit that place no more than six times per year. So here non-members can visit the gym. C says up to six occasions under guest terms. So the answer is C. Children are not allowed to use the leisure center. The keywords are children not allowed use leisure center. Those are the keywords. No? So children, it is about children. Then we need to go to the children section. Right. So children are not allowed use leisure center. Then when you just come to that line number one, the latter part of line number one, it starts like this. Children's hours are Monday to Friday, 10 a.m. to 12 noon and 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. That means if it comes to that evening time, maximum they can just stay there until 5 p.m. That means after 5, they can't be there. So children are not allowed after 5. Then what is the answer? G. After 5 p.m. on weekdays, children are not allowed to use the leisure center <coughs> after 5 p.m. on weekdays. Right? Rather than Right. The next one. 11 year olds. 11 year olds. Yes. What it says about 11 year olds, children. Last line. Mm -hmm. Children under the age of 12 are not allowed to use the steam room, hot spa and sauna. That means some areas are restricted for those 
children who are under uh, who are under 12 that means in that 11 category what is the answer cannot use all leisure center facilities answer is b so there are four questions to hands up those who have got four marks three all right okay then uh just come to question number 15 to 20 Question number 15 to 20. They are also just try to find out the keywords. Try to match the keywords with the sentences or the words given in that paragraph part. Then it will be very easy for you to find the answer. That is the most important. That's the crucial thing you have to do here. Okay, start doing that from 15 to 20. 